Okay, this is the Sunray Shadow Tube Fly. Uh, if you have a Petit Jean vise, you can remove the handle and put your Tube Fly tool on and put the nut back on. I've got a one to one and a half inch tube. I've got sheer 14 watt black, a little bit of wax on the tying thread will just begin there. I want to put a little foundation of tying thread. Just remove that. <coughs> A few, just a few millimetres and I've cut and removed most of the under fur from a uh, piece of white fox tail. Just measure that. Uh, I'll bring this up. We want this firstly, a little bit of wax again, to sit. We just secure it with a couple of turns and then what we want to do is just push it down each side of the hook uh, the each side of the tube ever so slightly and then we can go forward try and keep this neat and then what we do is we'll Trim all that off. Like so. We can go forward. Then what I want, once we've secured that, is a drop of super glue. Very important this. It will make your fly last a lot longer. Check that, that's good. Little ways, about half ways down the tube you want to push that. That'll do us that. Then what we need is a long slender length of black goat. And this wants to go on top of the hook, on top of the tube. Now make sure that your tying thread is right into the white wing. Straddler there, get rid of that. And we come in here and again we go over a couple of times and just work that hair with your nail. A little over each side. do as nicely there. A little bit of wax. I'll just stop your thread from slipping and we can come in again. That's good. Trim off that goat hair. Come back to our Super glue and drop on top again. I can work 
Kokowe forward. It has quite a large head, the Sunray, but we want a nice head on it. There we are, that's looking excellent. Then what we need is a peacock eye and we want three or four long hurl from this. So the hurl wants to be try and get them all in order. There we go. The hurl wants to be a little shorter than the goat wing. There we are. So place these on top of the tube and come in and go forward with three or four turns. Let's get a little bit further over. So I'll just reposition those. forward with a few turns like that. That's good. And then we bend these over. And we make a couple of turns of tying thread on top. And then we can just trim those off. And I'll spin my tying thread anti-clockwise to flatten it. go over the ends of the peacock curl like so whip finisher remove the tying thread and just give it a drop of varnish That is the finished Sunray Shadow. Great Atlantic Salmon Fly. If you enjoy the videos, please like, share, subscribe, and thanks for watching.